In this video, we're going to take an in-depth look at RF device integration on Avantis. For supported devices, you can now see key RF information right from Bankview. This includes the received RF signal level and the battery status of the transmitter. Further, more detailed information is available by touching the preamp section. Avantis 1.2 supports Sennheiser G3, G4, 300 and 500 series, along with 2000 and 2050 series receivers. These join the already supported Shure ULXD, QLXD and Axiant receivers. To connect to any RF device, you'll need to ensure your Avantis and receiver are on the same network and have compatible IP addresses. We have a separate video for setting up your network connection with a Dante-enabled device. Once your network connection is set up, navigate to Setup, Config, RF Devices and turn on RF Detection for the manufacturer you're using. You may use both simultaneously if you wish. Sennheiser devices must be added by IP address. This can be found from either Wireless Systems Manager or by using the controls on the front of the receiver. Shure devices will be automatically discovered by the console. For each device, you'll need to associate it with an input socket. This is the physical input number or the I.O. card socket if using Dante. Now, RF information will be displayed on the channel in Bankview and in the preamp section.